Today we're going to cover the best M4 in Warzone 2. Quick shout out to the Nodi gang and I hope you guys enjoy. Oh, running around knifing, getting into camo, so I can't hit, I can't even hate it. I feel you, bro. You gotta do what you gotta do. I'm gonna disengage. <sighs> so frustrating, bro. Completely waste my gulag off the rip because. Your squad mate is in the gulag now. If they survive, they'll be on multiple strong. Oh my god, why am I getting. I'm getting so many teammates capping out. Put them on the other team, bro. I love, like, now I'm prepared to sweat. Like, now they just want to fuck me over. But every time I was camel grinding, I always had to play catch up. Ugh. <laughs> well, it's because you're pushing them back now rather than, you know. That is true. I was using ass shit. Now that I'm just using OP shit, now they can't really touch me no more. All right. I really hate fighting down at this fucking little village, but... Gotta go. Thirty frames on raceway. Yeah, bump that shit up to one eighty. What you doing? Chill. No hit. Shots missed. <coughs> Enemy UAV Request overhead. Request an ordinance. Position marked. Copy. Mortar strike on the way. Your teammate. Damn, the scar with the line looks so sexy. On me. Damn near impossible to just. I hate how you can't run and play, bro. Bro was just there the whole time, Spa. Open. Yeah, you're not gonna out snipe me, bro. I even see his ass. It's done, great out. Fuck me. Uh, I missed my shot. Where the fuck are these guys all camping at, bro? You guys got to push right to me, man. <laughs> bump that shit. Bump, bump that shit up to 180. Yes, sir. I need all of the frames, bro. All of them. Fuck off. You two shot me from that. Oh, uh, this. That. The. Gas is moving in. New safe zone located. Marking shotgun ship. Target destroyed. I should not be going now. Love it. Oh, let me in the house, man. Um. Oh. Come on, give me a gun. Oh, dude, I got sniped as soon as I 
picked up a gun. Fucking people here. Advise you move to the safe zone now. Hostiles dropping in the area. Watch the skies. Oh. There it is. Oh, that's fucking dragging it. Zone, it don't matter. Like, we get in fucking in zone. Shit, I'm out of bullets, bro. Fuck. Over here. I just run out of bullets at the worst times. There's a kid in here. No, I'm dead. No, teammates, just look over me, bro. All right, man, I got a different kind of setup here on the M4 today. For the muzzle, we're going to start it off with the Gauge 9 Mono. This is like the monolithic suppressor from the previous games. It literally looks exactly the same. Gives us bullet velocity, sound suppression, recoil smoothness, and also a little bit of recoil control. Definitely needed for this M4 because this thing does have ever so little bit of kick to it. And I feel like this will definitely help out mitigate a lot of the recoil that this thing does have. And here's the tune on that. I lower it to 0.59 on the aim down sight speed side of things. And I also have it raised to 0.52 for the bullet velocity there. I feel like that's the sweet spot that I enjoy using on this weapon. You guys know maxing out the sliders isn't actually like the best thing you can possibly do for these guns in a lot of the scenarios. So uh, definitely play around with the tuning here. This is what I was using. If it works for you, great. If it doesn't, then just mess around and find whatever uh, works for you guys. And uh, nothing's changed up in the barrel here. I'm still rocking the high tower barrel, giving us bullet velocity, damage range, recoil control, and then adds on a little bit of hit fire accuracy, which is really not the biggest deal for us the hit fire actually on an ar is like kind of redundant but i mean it's a nice bonus to have on there right and here's the tune on that i have it raised to 0 0.27 on the recoil steadiness side of things and then i do in fact have it maxed out on the bottom slider towards the damage range since i think that is the best way to go on the barrel for the underbarrel today nothing changed up there we got the f tac ripper 56 on still boosting the aiming idle stability hip fire accuracy again and then really focusing on that recoil stabilization helping us hit our targets at the longer ranges the tune on this as follows i got it raised to 0.32 on the recoil stabilization side of things and then i would actually lower it to the aim walking speed ever so slightly at 0.17 today i'm rocking the 45 round mag on here the 60 just takes off so much mobility and i'm not a fan of that and last but not least we actually changed it up today i'm rocking the choreo factory stock on here this boosts the aiming stability and the recoil control making this thing laser accurate at those longer ranges and here is the tuning for the stock i have it lowered all the way to the wards the aim down sight speed then i also have it raised to 1.39 for the aiming idle stability and hopping into the firing range you guys seen in the gameplay this thing is super easy to control and it is also very good at longer ranges man and yeah man that's gonna be the end of the video i hope you guys enjoyed today's gameplay class out of whatever it might be like comment subscribe to the channel if you guys are brand new man it's been excellent so catch you in the next one peace out